Leading up to this year's Winter Olympics in Sochi, Russia, there were great concerns about the possibility of terrorist attacks. Thankfully, the games have been completely safe so far. That wasn't the case back in 1972 at the Summer Olympics in Munich, Germany. U.S. Olympian Jane Frederick was one of the last people to see the Israeli hostages alive. Santa Barbara resident Jane Frederick competed at the 1972 and 1976 Summer Olympics. She was the first great American female multi-eventer. She set over 20 U.S. records in a pentathlon and a heptathlon. She was 20 years old at the 72 Olympics in Munich. We were at Lake Tahoe, I guess, when I finally made the standard, and I was assured of a place. But during the second week of action, a Palestinian group known as Black September took advantage of lax security on the early hours of September 5th to kidnap 11 members of the Israeli Olympic team. Two were killed immediately, leaving nine hostages. It was an off day for track and field events, so Frederick and others had gone out sightseeing, only to return later that day to find the horror that was taking place at the Olympic Village. We had walked out the front about a half hour after they had begun in the back. We came back that evening to find that uh, the entire village, neighborhood, etc., had been completely transformed, you know, into basically a military police zone. German police agreed to bust the terrorists and the hostages to awaiting helicopters that would eventually take them to an airport. Frederick saw the hostages walk off the bus and into the helicopters. They all came out of the bus. Buses, there were military buses below me, right? Right below me. I was just with all the, yeah, and got into that big transport helicopter and up they went and off they went. But chaos broke out at the airport and all of the hostages were killed. ABC sportscaster Jim McKay broke the news to the world. They have now said that there were 11 hostages. Two were killed in their rooms this mo yesterday morning. Nine were killed at the airport tonight. They're all gone. Oh, yeah. No, I didn't talk about it for years because I realized um, we were the last people probably to see them alive. A memorial service was held at Olympic Stadium on September 6th, and the games continued. I was absolutely adamant in my own attitude that, of course, we should continue competing. We should continue competing in their honor, in their memory. Jane Frederick placed 21st in a pentathlon in 1972 and 7th in the same event in the 1976 Olympics. And she said in that 76 Olympics, the security was night and day compared oh, sure. to Munich. We were Munich. just talking about that. Yeah, yeah. and they did that intentionally things. in Munich because of the 1936 Olympics in Berlin. Hitler's Olympics were so fear that they wanted a nice serene Relax. Olympics. Yeah, yeah, and they paid the that. price for it. Well, she um, certainly added some memories. Oh, she is great insight. to talk to. She looks great.